With Detroit struggling to pay its bills right now, the Fox 2 problem solvers uncover some payments that will have you shaking your head. Fox 2's Charlie Ledup joins us tonight with a story of more money being wasted. Charlie. Yeah, well, now I still get calls from people complaining about the money wasted on cars for the city council. But I found out we're paying certain city officials who were recently bounced in sex scandals so much money that we could buy the council a whole new fleet of cars four times over. Hey, Detroit, you know what we do when we find out our prominent officials are What do we do, John? We keep them on the payroll! You remember Detroit Police Chief Ralph Godby caught up last October loving, leaving, and breaking the hearts of his female subordinates? Chief, have you, have you turned the police department into Hugh Hefner's bunny patch? And then he got canned by Mayor Bing, who allowed him to retire. Chief Godby has submitted a letter announcing his retirement effective immediately. Well, then how come Godby still getting paid by a city that can't pay its cops, can't pay its firefighters, and can't pay its bills? I'd love to know where's the money that is being paid to him. I'd love to know where's the money that we have to give to all these people to do restructuring 65 times. What do you, what do, you do? What am I supposed to do? And I have to scrub, scrub toilets and work side jobs to make my, my bills. Now, nobody's seen God be around the place doing any work. But according to these payroll stubs obtained by Fox 2 News, Godby still gets regular pay, holiday pay, he earns vacation days, and sick leave. Now, sometimes he fills out his check with bank time from when he was not supposedly retired. Right now, he is not being paid by the police and fire retirement system. And according to the reports that I have in front of me here, it's obvious that he's still being carried uh, on the books. But, 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 but the mayor said... Effective immediately. Right now. As in not tomorrow. Effective immediately. Immediately effective. True. Word. I don't understand how we're paying for two police chiefs. Should they just kick him to the curb? Again, um, that's the mayor and uh, his staff, and uh, I think he will be better able to answer that question. And here he is, his staff. Can you, since you're the press guy, why are we still paying Gabby? He retired. No comment. Now, current chief or former chief or co-chief or whatever Gabby is, isn't the only horn dog growing a public check in Detroit? Hot dog. Yep, that's me. Yeah, no, shoot, no, no shame to my game. Now, new texter and Third Circuit Court Judge Wade McCree got into his own hot water in December after he revealed that the buff barrister had impregnated a young woman who had a child support case before him. Judge, you said you'd give her anything if she aborted the baby, so why'd you call the prosecutor on her? What did she do wrong? He made a fool of himself and the court. But even though the court's broke, they're still paying the judge $12,000 a month. Now that made the Judicial Tenure Commission so mad that we found out they've asked the Michigan Supreme Court to suspend McCree without pay while they investigate. Highly unusual. Now let me say this loud and clear. Good governance starts from the top. And if you want to get things fixed, you know where to look. In downtown Detroit, Charlie Duff, Fox 2 News. This one here? Where a lot of, we need to talk about a lot of things, you not wearing pants for one thing, but. <laughs> it was uh, cold out. I bet it was. I want to know what the city's policy says about situations just like this. When someone retires or resigns, you know. I, wouldn't their retirement kick in, not. I would love check? so badly to be able to sit here and sound smart and tell you what the policy is, but it's getting to the point, I don't know what the policy is. He resigns effective immediately, which means you no longer draw money, you no longer collect vacation time, sick time, you get your checks, and you go. Effective immediately. But this thing's stretching out. I don't know if he's waiting for a 25th year so he can get his full pension or what deal they made, but as you see, we go to the mayor, explain it to us. What amazes me is that the chairman of the police commission had no idea it was going on. Or the DPOA, he also sits on the pension board, nobody knew. So can we get a straight answer here and a straight solution to stuff? The accounting office. And somebody signs was, the yeah, check. Yeah, somebody signing the check. Yeah. Now, as, as far as McCree goes, uh, the Supreme Court might make that decision next week. And his lawyer told me tonight that he's embarrassed, he's humiliated, he's getting some help, but he fully expects to be back on the bench.
Now, Charlie, I know that you're an investigative reporter, but there are some things that should always be covered up, including <laughs> your legs. <laughs> Wear some pants next time. Then why should I run? Those are good-looking legs. No? Thanks, Charlie. Send it to Facebook. Charlie. Okay. <laughs>